Hello, my name is Eugen Vasiliev. Today we are going to speak about Naftapos software for petrol stations. Naftapos software is a software intended for automation of petrol station at its process. It is to be installed on the personal computers or POS systems to provide complete management over petrol station activity. Uh, control over fuel dispensers and uh, tanks with uh, ATG systems is made by connection of PTS controller, uh, which uh, has uh, communication protocols of mostly used uh, and uh, manufactured fuel dispensers and ATG systems uh, in the world. All uh, equipment required for uh, operation of uh, uh, petrol stations, uh, provision of sales uh, is connected directly to a post terminal with Nafta Post software and uh, the using drivers already set in Nafta Post. Uh, Nafta Post also operates with price boards and uh, provides uh, uh, management and sales of uh, sales of products uh, using the customers' um, cards. Now uh, I have already installed Nafta Post software on this uh, computer and uh, I will show to you how it works. Uh, first of all, we need to say that uh, after installation of Nafta Post software, there are two versions, two uh, uh, executable files to be around. Uh, first of all, it's full version of Nafta Post software, and second version is trial version, which uh, serves for evaluation purposes. Uh, difference uh, is that uh, for uh, running of trial version you should have the constant internet connection on the PC where the system is run. I will start trial version. At starting of the system uh, it uh, checks all the configuration. And system uh, begins operation. Uh, Nafta Post software is uh, made to uh, suit two different uh, requirements of customers and uh, to be flexibly adjusted. Uh, in uh, for this video, I set up uh, Nafta Post software to uh, make it work uh, with working shifts. Uh, when uh, in the uh, beginning of operation, a cashier should uh, open a new working shift, uh, make all the sales during the day and uh, after the day is uh, finished uh, to close all the, uh, the working shifts and uh, uh, return to the system uh, money according to uh, indication of the payments uh, to be collected during the working shift in the system. So uh, now I will continue the working shift which I previously started. I will need to enter my uh, login password uh, of cashier, which is my personal information and system leads all the sales uh, on, uh, on my name uh, during this working shift. Um, for this current uh, user I do not have any password, uh, but if I had and entered incorrect password, it, the system will show me that the password is incorrect and will not allow me to enter the system. So I made it correctly. There is no password here. Uh, and uh, first of all, we will watch how the system looks like. So the new uh, shift uh, has started. Uh, we see on the screen uh, eight, eight uh, windows of pumps. Uh, we see also the uh, window for sales of products in product shop. And we see also the table of tanks. A table of tanks with uh, current remains of uh, fuel in tanks. Uh, so uh, the interface of the system is uh, rather adjustable and each uh, user can set it under his personal taste, his personal requirements, with location of the windows, of their colors, their position, their scale as exactly he needs. Uh, what we'll do now, we will change the position of the windows on the screen. 
uh, I should select it. First of all, we will not need the sales table. We will disable it. Uh, we will uh, remove the uh, pump windows to another location, make it more uh, tightly uh, located. Uh, also, we will remove the uh, tank table to a new new position, and maybe we'll change so something to make it more interesting. For example, we can change the uh, there are different options in uh, each of the window. We can change its colors uh, of active window, of uh, inactive window, scale. Let's make it let's make it big. For this dispenser, we will have a big. We we'll think that it is a very, very important, very important pump, and uh, everyone needs needs to have it seen from the far distance. Um, also, um, it's possible not only modify the uh, layout of the main panel of not possible but also it's possible to change the skin of it to make the system exactly suit to any taste now i have the material ue uh, skin and i will change it to some uh, to some dark uh, dark uh, skin like this one which uh, is quite comfortable to to be used uh, in order to make uh, cashier eyes uh, be uh, healthy and not to uh, be very much uh, impressed by all these uh, bright colors. We can select any other skin, for example, make it gray or make it uh, make it golden, for example. So there are many possibilities to play with skin and select the skin as as uh, a user needs. Okay, uh, now we'll uh, see how uh, operation with fuel dispensers is to be made. For this, I prepared uh, a simulator of fuel dispenser. I don't have uh, at the moment with me the fuel dispenser. Of course, I'm uh, working in office, and uh, that's why we will run a simulator of a fuel dispenser, which will emulate the presence of fuel dispenser uh, connected to NAFTA post system. So I start the uh, simulator, and uh, see that the simulator has eight uh, pumps currently adjusted uh, to operate and all these pumps are uh, now uh, being pulled by the NAFTA POST software. Uh, for example, if I take up a nozzle on the pump number 2, let's make it also second uh, second uh, nozzle, we see that this nozzle is up. Uh, NAFTA POST system has several modes of control over uh, fuel dispensers, uh, one of which is called preset. Uh, it's currently set on the in NAFTA POST. Uh, this preset mode. Uh, this mode means that uh, order is uh, presetted. So uh, this mode needs is needed for uh, uh, purposes when order is given by the cashier who receives uh, payments from customers uh, from the office uh, located at the petrol station. Exactly, uh, cashier is responsible for uh, controlling, providing control over the fuel dispensers. Uh, let's see how it works. The cashier enters uh, the amount to be dispensed in uh, either uh, liters or um, currency amounts and uh, remotely starts a fuel dispenser process. The fuel dispenser begins uh, dispensing fuel and uh, currently this information is uh, displayed in uh, NAFTA POST software. 
uh, which provides monitoring of activity of each uh, fuel dispenser and uh, cashier can, can anytime uh, stop any of the fuel dispensers from uh, being dispensed uh, here is a button stop and here is also a possibility to uh, stop all the dispensers or uh, emergency close all the orders after the dispensing is uh, performed uh, Naftapos software uh, reads totalizers total counters of the uh, given uh, fuel dispenser and stores them uh, all this data about transaction in its database second modes of control uh, uh, which we will now watch is called manual modes. Uh, in manual modes, uh, control over dispensers is made by fuel attendants who work near the fuel dispensers and uh, collects payments from customers. Uh, so when the uh, car with of the customer arrives to the petrol station, the uh, fuel attendants. Uh, takes up uh, the nozzle, uh, inserts it into his uh, into the car, and presses the trigger on. Upon this, uh, the fuel dispensing process begins. We'll watch how it is done. For example, uh, we select here the manual mode of operation. Uh, take up the nozzle number three. Nafta post software sees it at, uh, at the same time and authorizes a dispenser. The dispensing process begins and information about uh, dispensing is uh, at once seen in Nafta post software. When the nozzle is down, Nafta post software uh, displays the totally dispensed fuel, uh, reads uh, the total counters and stores them to database. In addition, Nafta Post software can print uh, receipts uh, for each of the dispensing mates on the uh, connected uh, receipts printer. Uh, Nafta Post software has uh, ability to uh, print uh, receipts on any of the supported printers uh, which has uh, have drivers uh, for uh, Windows operation system and uh, as a receipt uh, you can uh, flexibly form any of the receipts uh, because uh, Naftapost has a template of receipts and any of the information which should be contained in the receipt can be uh, uh, added to this template. It can be text, uh, its position on the, on the receipts, uh, logos of the company, images and so on. During the uh, in, working in this mode gives a possibility uh, for uh, Naftapos to remotely monitor activity of each uh, fuel dispenser and uh, write uh, to database all information about uh, each uh, fuel dispensing being, being performed. Uh, as to tanks, uh, remains and uh, petroleum f parameters of uh, fuel on in tanks, Naftapos uh, remotely monitors each of the tanks uh, and its uh, petroleum parameters of fuel stored in them. Uh, I have here the simulator of tanks connected and I have displaying of the tanks on the working panel or in Naftapost software. Uh, here I have four tanks and this is a simulation of each tank. Uh, let's make uh, changes of uh, uh, petroleum levels stored in the tanks and uh, see how it will be displayed uh, by the Naftapost software. Uh, this is like a small uh, displaying of the uh, tanks uh, in Naftapost we can uh, have another bigger window which shows exactly uh, each of the tanks in the system and its parameters. Uh, there are two options for connected ATG systems. Uh, for the ATG system which gives out only levels of uh, petroleum, of water and temperature in tank, uh, Naftapos can lead uh, calibration charts of each uh, tank 
and uh, calculates uh, volume uh, according to this data. Or if the ATG system uh, supports uh, calculation of volume, uh, then uh, NAFTAPOST software can take all this data from the ATG system. Uh, now we will watch uh, some other uh, possibilities of the uh, system. Uh, let's start from uh, tab uh, fuel. Uh, there is possibility to set uh, prices on the uh, fuel uh, being sold. Make uh, reception of fuel. For example, we want to receive some uh, some value. For example, 1,000 liters into tank number two. We can make a fast fuel reception, or uh, we can make a fuel reception when we will specify exactly the uh, fuel parameters of uh, received uh, fuel. In tank number two, we st begin fuel reception, and when the fuel reception is made, uh, by the way, we can uh, disallow dispensing of fuel of the uh, grades. Uh, which is now being received. So uh, to make it uh, uh, the situation on the petrol station be safe, uh, when the petroleum product is being received, uh, NAFTA Post software can uh, disallow uh, dispensing of this uh, fuel grade. And in the end of the fuel being received, we can uh, make select the tank. Uh, inputs number of way bill under which the fuel was received, enter the supplier, enter the, from which storage uh, depots was the fuel was uh, delivered, fuel truck number, number of route, all this information is uh, important for uh, reports to be built, and information about what the, what was the volume of petroleum dispensed, its uh, mass, its uh, density, temperature, and so on. And click uh, OK at fuel reception. That it's completed. Uh, next, what I, I wanted to show to you is uh, how it's. Uh, convenient to see totalizers of each pump in the system. Uh, we can build uh, reports on each of the uh, pump totalizers uh, and it's also comfortable to see each of the totalizers uh, in uh, volume or in money mounts in the system uh, on which we can compare with uh, fuel dispensers and see whether there were, were any uh, dispensing during the uh, working periods because after the end of each uh, transaction after post stores uh, reads and stores the totalizers in the system now let's see how sales of products in the petrol station shop uh, is to be made we will return our sales table located on the uh, interface of the of the system Okay, uh, the products in the shop are to be so, uh, sold uh, using either a barcode scanner or uh, manually uh, inputting them in the system. The cashier can uh, select them from the database, uh, see this at once the whole sum of products and also he can um, manually input uh, product codes or make it using the barcode scanner to make it fast. 
select quantity and make the sales of uh, the baskets of the whole uh, products baskets uh, specifying what was the money received from the customer there are uh, up to five product baskets in Naftapos uh, each can be filled independently we can make uh, payouts if the customer returns back the product or there was some problem with sales of products also there are some additional fields to be added here for example we can add discounts on some products and product will be sold with with the discounts system allows us to make reception of products when new products or previously uh, entered in the system products can be added we can see all the products on stock search the product by their quotes or different attributes we can make a review of all the sales performed by the system using different payment forms uh, we can see total information about uh, different uh, sales made using different payment forms separately on pumps, separately on products, on sales select the working shift during which the products were sold and see the receptions review uh, Naftapos system can have different uh, languages uh, new languages are to be added rather quickly and rather simply so uh, the question of localization is uh, quickly to be solved uh, when a new language uh, needs to be added to the system now we will speak about reporting in the system how rep reports are uh, printed by the system select reports tab and there are uh, three uh, types of reports uh, report, uh, reports can be made on uh, fuel sales, on product sales and there are also analytics reports uh, for analysis, analysis of uh, sales made and uh, which uh, products are better sold or uh, needs to have a better uh, needs a better strategy to be sold uh, example of report is for example sales of fuel select uh, working shifts uh, through which we want to see the reports select some uh, filters on pumps or on uh, fuel codes make some sorting on the reports and print these reports uh, the report is printed and uh, shown how to it will be um, watched uh, when it will be printed on the uh, standard printer we can make its export to pdf uh, here i have pdf but actually we can make it to excel uh, html and other formats As to reports on analytics, we can see, for example, uh, which uh, product is, uh, was uh, more sold uh, in, uh, in the system uh, during the shifts which I uh, was uh, working in. Uh, new reports are added upon the customer's requests and uh, uh, rather quickly to the system. Now we will see how it's uh, easy and quick to make configuration of the system uh, to make it uh, op working at the petrol station on the real installation. In order to provide uh, configuration, here is the configuration. 
which has uh, different tabs uh, described in the manual, uh, user manual of Naptapo system and we will quickly see how exactly uh, system is adjusted. Uh, on the general tab we have some general information about the system, whether the uh, level matter is present or not, uh, shifts should be laddered or not, uh, working shifts should be laddered and system should work without working shifts. Uh, some permissions to set uh, on the operation of Naftapo system. Also we have here, uh, should the system work with, uh, like on post terminal with touch screen or uh, on a PC with mouse and keyboard. Uh, tab uh, database uh, exactly provides information about uh, database used in the system and uh, allows to uh, make backup restore of database. Uh, for example, for the situations when uh, there is necessity to uh, migrate from one PC which was working with Naftapo software to another PC and to save all data, all database, all adjustments, all configurations. Uh, here is a very um, convenient tool for um, uh, backupping the full um, Naftapo uh, software and uh, after that restoring uh, where we can select exactly which uh, things we need to backup and restore in future. We can view any of the uh, data tables in the system. For example, table sales, uh, which sales were made, and uh, correct them or uh, export to any of the external sources. As the same as uh, external uh, software can uh, address to Naftapo software to read its database and use this data in their um, calculation and accounts. Uh, here we have uh, configuration of the uh, pumps. Uh, when uh, how how should uh, the uh, pumps work? How should they display their errors and uh, working statuses? Uh, tab drivers uh, serves for uh, configuration of the equipment connected to Naftapo software. For example, to read uh, to print receipts, it is necessary to select here the one of the drivers uh, for uh, working with printer. And inside of it, uh, sets which will be the template of the receipt to be printed. Uh, it's paper white. It's uh, some other fields. For example, text rate. Uh, which of the uh, controller for for record controller uh, will be used with the system? Now it's uh, set to PTS controller. It can uh, be uh, other uh, controllers in different configurations of system. Uh, also, uh, controllers for working with ATG systems for co controlling for working with barcode scanners, other other uh, connected equipment. Uh, here is the tanks uh, tab. Uh, here we have adjustments of uh, tanks to be uh, used with system and the products inside of them. Also, the system leads uh, calibration charts of each of the tanks uh, to which uh, height of the tank corresponds to which volume of the tank. Configuration of pumps, quantity of pumps, and their linking to. Uh, to uh, tanks, uh, so that uh, we know that for uh, this pump exactly uh, its uh, nozzles are linked to these fuel grades. Selection of the payment forms to be used in system. Configuration regarding how the order should be calculated and uh, receipts to be printed. Be, uh, it will be prepayments, post payments, and uh, splitting of uh, product basket and so on. Uh, configuration of the view uh, of the system, which uh, windows will be shown uh, on the main panel, uh, how to display them, which of the skins skin to uh, to use, etc., etc. Uh, 
let's make it some something more uh, more uh, user friendly uh, pump modes uh, pump modes which means it's uh, what of the pump modes will be used in the system uh, how to provide control over uh, pumps will it be preset from the nafta post or it will be nafta post will simply monitor uh, how dispensers work uh, setting of discounts setting also of difference uh, additional connected plugins uh, to the system uh, which allow additional possibilities configuration of uh, passwords and logins of cashiers and setting of their permissions to the system all of this is uh, nafta post software and it allows um, convenient of operation of uh, petrol station convenient management of it and uh, it's quite easy in understanding easy in operation in adjustments and uh, management over the petrol station activity and uh, brings to the owner of petrol station uh, tools for uh, making his petrol station work exactly as he needs so that is in brief uh, description of nafta post system uh, possibilities and uh, more detailed information can be always found on uh, nafta post web page where uh, there is also a user manual to be downloaded which contains information about latest possibilities of nafta post software and its description thank you for watching this video for any questions regarding uh, technical support or uh, any assistance can be asked from our um, uh, mailbox or uh, contacts uh, which are uh, located on our website. We will be always glad to help you.